If you like Arduino and building electronics, being in control of your data and making a smart home your way, then the Motino framework is for you. I focused on designing a simple yet feature-rich framework of connected devices that enable beginners and makers alike to add convenience and security to their home and living space. The result was the Motino framework which I submitted to the Hackaday Prize to show my progress and latest projects, and I was very happy it made it into the semi-finals. This means automation is getting more and more attention, and this is very motivating for me to improve my work and bring my new ideas to fruition going forward. Some of the projects I documented in the logs and on my blog include my own version of a garage controller that can check if the garage door was left open by mistake and close it from my mobile device. Also, I really wanted to be able to control my lights remotely, and that effort led me through several revisions of switch mode. A wireless light switch that can replace mechanical switches in regular and three-way circuits without special arrangements or new home wiring. Switch mode is made up of a mains power supply that can be paired with Motino to wirelessly control a 5 amp 250 volt load through the onboard relay or it can be soldered to a switch mode shield with up to three buttons and pairs of LEDs that you can use any way you'd like within your Motino automation network. Here's another Motino shield that I've worked on since I submitted my entry. It can be used as a motion detector or standalone display shield to display messages on the wireless network. It features an on-off switch, a general purpose button which in my case is programmed to browse through past received messages, it has a buzzer for audio feedback, and it also features easy USB charging and programming. The Gateway is a Raspberry Pi that runs an SSL secured NGINX and Node.js WebSocket stack which delivers authenticated real-time two-way updates to any connected clients anywhere on the web. Since I submitted my THP entry, I enhanced this gateway to support battery backup for more security and to avoid any sudden power loss and consequently downtime and possible SD card corruption. The details are in the project log and on my blog at lowpowerlab.com. As before, we have the LCD display which also shows wireless network activity like the standalone display mode and of course the power button which allows easy shutdowns and restarts without the need to log into the Pi. The web connectedness of this project and its relevance to its function is fully obvious and is at the foundation of this whole framework. In other words, you could not find a more truly connected project than this. The various Motino nodes exchange their data with the gateway securely through AES encrypted wireless packets and the gateway relays that data to all the web clients in real time. Any requests from clients are relayed back to the target nodes to trigger specific actions like closing the garage door or turning lights on or off. This is a powerful combination of features that truly sets the Motino framework apart from any other open source automation networks. So, let's summarize why the Motino framework is superior and why it should make it in the THP finals. It's open source and based on Arduino, which is already familiar to so many. It has a variety of already fully functional sub-projects and well-documented examples. It's fun to assemble and put together while teaching yourself or your kids soldering, programming, and using a Raspberry Pi. And very easy to customize and extend with your own projects and ideas. On the technical side, AES encrypted wireless transmissions and SSL secured and authenticated web traffic make it a truly robust and worry-free framework of internet connected things. Wireless over-the-air programming is a flagship feature of Motinos which allows dependable and quick hands-free updates to nodes deployed in difficult locations. Motinos are built with passion and I believe so much in my vision that I took a quantum leap of faith and invested in professional assembly equipment to help me make better quality hardware more efficiently. Also, let's not forget the aesthetic build of the functional nodes like switch mode that blend perfectly where mechanical switches once were and make my friends curious. And did I mention this is wireless? I think I did. I mean, there are no wires hanging on my walls to and from my light switches, like in other projects, which would ruin the look and feel of my home decor. And there are even more features that you can discover yourself and feature ideas and projects that will be added to the growing Motino framework. Thanks for watching and I hope you find my project interesting and useful and will deem it worthy of being a Hackaday Prize finalist.